oh shoot, y'all heard about that, Dwight? They said Dwight was in a uh, text message and a guy. Obviously, it was something that I had to address. Nigga, who cares? Wait, damn it. We're going to have to stop the presses. We're going to have to push that back. Because Dwight Howard, of all people, got to be front page news. Dwight Howard deserves to have his voice heard on any matters pertaining to his personal life. So who am I to stop that? Here's Dwight Howard speaking to y'all, to me and everybody else, himself. Listen up. Whatever I'm doing in my bedroom is my damn business. Whatever you doing in your bedroom is your damn business. That ain't for everybody. And everybody don't need to know. You ain't got to say anything about what you're doing in your fucking house. It's your house. You ain't got to explain that to nobody. No matter what they say, they can say anything. Who gives two shits? Y'all too damn nosy worried about what I'm doing in my bed. People who know what's going on in my bed, they know what the hell going on with my bed. That ain't nobody business where I put my shit at. Y'all just weird. If you want to know what people doing in their bedroom and who they messing with and sleeping with, you are weird. You're the weird one. Oh, shoot. Y'all heard about that, Dwight? They said Dwight was in a uh, text message and a guy. Nigga, who cares? I know I don't have no problem with him. He live his life. I'm a heterosexual brother. You know, that's not how I roll. But I ain't knocking somebody else for rolling differently. That's their preference. It's his business. And he's absolutely right when he says it's his business. And I would come to the White House's defense all day, every day, by saying it is his business. I don't like those people who lie about it. I don't like those people who sit up there and, 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 and pretend that they are something that they are not. That I don't like. But as long as you're honest and open, and the people that you're dealing with know exactly who you are, what you do is your business. No doubt about it. Here's where it's relevant to Dwight Howard. And one of my producers, Greg, will emphatically agree with me. I have no doubt when I say what I'm about to say. That might have something to do with you not being on an NBA team right now. Now, I know they don't want to admit it. I know. We want to sit up there and just applaud and we want to act like everything's cool and everything's okay. I get it. Jason Collins, former NBA player, came out. John Amici, he came out. Isaac Humphreys. That is not to say that everybody in the NBA is all heterosexual and all of that other stuff. What I'm saying is when they take into account the totality of your impact in the locker room and on a roster, your behavior on the court as well as off of it impacts their decisions. And it's not about whether you're gay or straight, whether you're bi or gay, whether you're transgender or whatever. It's not about that. What it's about is how you live. It's not about your sexual orientation. It's not about your sexual preferences. It's about how you live. And if somebody's accusing you of sexual assault, or, you pop, or, or, or you're outed as being somebody that's hooking up with folks on Instagram, it's a different animal. He is right, though. It's none of our damn business. And I want Dwight Howard to know, I didn't bring it up to get in your business. I would never have revealed the story like that if I knew it and nobody else knew it. I would never do that. I only touched on it because it was publicized and it was all over the damn place. And oh, by the way, it's still your damn business. I'm only bringing it up because I'm like, yo, that got to be the reason you ain't in the league. Because there's no excuse to me why Dwight Howard can't be on an NBA roster. There's just no excuse for that to me. Not the way he takes care of himself, not the condition that he's in, and not with the defensive prowess that he has. That's all I'm saying. But he's absolutely right. Ain't none of our damn business. 